I was attracted to these Kreuter slip joint pliers because of their small size and the interesting grip pattern on the handles. I thought these pliers would be a good second project for the fiber wheels. They came apart pretty easily. I gave the parts a quick wire brushing to remove the loose rust. I decided to give citric acid a try. I was hoping that in addition to removing the rust, the acid would also attack what was left of the plating. I wasn't very precise with the mixture. I just scooped some into a tub of warm water. Here's the parts after soaking in the citric acid solution for about an hour. I was hoping that the little bubbles meant the acid was working. After soaking overnight, I noticed that some of the rust had come off the parts. I gave the parts a scrub with a wire brush and let them soak some more. So here's what my science experiment looked like after 24 hours. Check out the film floating on top of the liquid. The film was mimicking the shape of the part at the bottom of the tub. Weird. I gave the parts another scrub. I was a little bit concerned about all of the black stuff that was coming off. I decided it was time to end my experiment. I gave the parts a bath in warm water and baking soda to neutralize the acid. Here's the parts rinsed and dried. The citric acid was effective on the rust, but it appeared to have no effect on the plating. I ran the parts through the coarse wire wheel. I was hoping the wire wheel would knock off more of the plating. It did a nice job on the pattern in the handles, but that plating was proving tough to remove. My next step was the 180 grit fiber wheel. I was impressed with the sparks that came off the wheel as I worked. I used my hand drill to help me polish the pivot pin. Here's how the parts looked after the 180 grit fiber wheel. I think I got most of the plating off. Unfortunately, the pitting on these pliers was very deep. This wheel is supposed to be 320 grit. The wheel is noticeably softer than the other one, but I don't think the finish it in parts is much different. Here's how the parts looked after the softer wheel. I was pretty happy with the finish considering I did no sanding on these parts at all.
Chuck is chomping at the bit to break into that new tub of flits. I won't let him open it until the old tube is completely used up. These little pliers had some significant corrosion. That plated finish is my least favorite tool finish. Come on Chuck, quit fooling around. This is supposed to be a serious tool restoration video. Let's try this again. I think they came out decent. Keep in mind that I went straight from the wire wheel to the fiber wheel with absolutely no sanding. This project gave me a better feel for the capabilities of the fiber wheels. And I'll keep that citric acid around as a budget alternative to the Evaporust. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Let's see how well these pliers work. This is just a piece of wire clothes hanger. Not bad.